Try it. Fuel pump's going out. All right, Chris, great news. What's that? This is not some random dude's garage. No, I actually know this guy. <laughs> Koji-san. I know, I like walked around the corner, I was like, oh, what's oh, up, yeah. I know you. I feel a whole lot better about this. <laughs> he like comes around the corner, he's like, oh, it's your car. <laughs> Is that fine, Chris? Yeah, I think it's fine. Okay, okay, I'm so sorry. It's not you, it's me. <laughs> All right, so we're on the way to the Hub Dino now. Walking. Like Have fun walking, losers. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I didn't do that just to make a fire up today. <laughs> it's been there for uh, 12 years. Nope, I'm sorry. Nope. It's been like that since, well, since 09. Yeah, because Kevin Wells originally uh, wired this thing up. So it has a SR20 Power FC on it. Mm -hmm. And it's been running like that, like I said, since 09. You just put the SR20 disc in it, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Okay, just start it. Ready to start? Because it's it's not in the oh, window. Yeah, <laughs> and we we were trying to. Uh, yeah, it's one off, man, for sure. Yeah, right. <laughs> That's all I was saying. Like, I and and every time I was playing with it, it just landed in that same spot. <laughs> like, so I'm doing something wrong. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to you can fix it, Come right back it's, in. It's easier if you open this one, so you could see it's it's actually the housing moves. Yeah. So if the discs, yeah. Yeah, so I know this is what we were trying to do back at the shop, and I was just like, just struggling with it. If you take off the cover, you can actually see the disc is offset. Yeah. Okay. Just give it a start. What? Hang on, keep going. Keep going. Horsepower guesses, go. Blow or I don't know what. Blown? What? Something's gonna blow? Oh god no. no. Don't say things like that. <laughs> Please don't say things like that. <laughs> Chris, what did this thing make last time? Oh, you can't do that. That's not uh, like that. No, it's like when it was the stock stock motor, it was like 310 forever. And then uh, Tommy and the other guy were like, you'll be good like at like 350, 360. Dynapacks usually read a little low. So what's your guess, Chris? Well, it's not a guess, it's just where we stopped. No, I mean like, no, I'm saying for the new, the, no, Chris, I'm talking about right now. What do you think we're gonna make today? Oh, oh, no, I, I, I'm looking for like three, like 40. I'm gonna say 339. 337. Wow. 341. Oh, I'm going on the high side. I'm gonna say 356. Okay. Yeah, that's a good number. Yeah. All right. Everyone there. You wanna check his side? 
Jackson is a foreman now. I've done this before. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Are you, hey, it looks are good, buddy. Hey, it looks good, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> yep, the hub is a hub. It's yep. hub. It's hub. We're fully hubbed up. Hubby. Hubba, 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 dude. That's crazy, man. Reads lower. Uh, I mean, like all dinos read different. Dino jets read the highest. And then Mustang dinos read pretty low. These read pretty low. But like when it comes to like dino queen, <laughs> you need that jet, dude. <laughs> Keep the, the, the momentum on the rollers. <laughs> <laughs> He, uh, he was showing me the mapping, it was very wavy. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so he's, uh, I think he's gonna start us fresh. Whole new map. Yeah, he's just gonna load in a, an SR map and build off of that instead of trying to build off of whatever was in here. So we have that saved, so that exists, but trying to fix every nook and cranny is gonna be more difficult than just working with a fresh, smooth graph. Dropping on top end? Yeah. I gotta go pee. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's like what I was saying. I was like, I don't know why it's doing that so hard. That's like what it, how it was driving before. It used to be super peaky on the old setup, on the old engine. And then um, when we put the new motor and everything else and put it on there, my, I attribute it to the turbo size. Yeah, I noticed it was rolling over pretty hard. I thought maybe just because we're not in the efficiency range, and it does look like it just richens up, but it, yeah. It just drops to hardcore. Yeah. Yeah. So maybe you have a injector seal leak? Maybe? Did you do a boost leak check? Did not. Is my light here? Let me do a flashlight. What intake cam timing? I mean, you guys did the timing, right? Nothing. Oh, oh with where it. it was. We timed it how it was when we took it apart. Oh, oh, you guys didn't do it to factory spec. We did it per what it came off and marked the cam with the chain where it came off. This is what we were talking about when we saw that, that you know, how you pointed out that that load mm -hmm. wasn't quite there. Mm -hmm. And I was like, well, this is, this is how it was. Hmm? I was kind of wet there. Get this in. Oh, that was because this is used it? to. Yeah? Yeah. What would happen if the um, if the cam timing was off? <laughs> I think it's not gonna make power here if the cam timing's off. It's it's gonna be. Well, actually, it does. It's, be because it is possible when you put it at top dead center. You know how the lobe is normally supposed to be like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The one was like Instead this. Of being flat, it was like that. And it looked weird to me, but that's how it was. That's how the car was running. See, I'm not. A K guy, so I don't know. They saw it. Yeah. Yeah, it's always like that. Yeah. Yeah. It looked like it was too thought. Like this too, yeah. right? You would think. Yeah. So Full closed. The left side is the intake side, yes. right? So it was like this? Yes. Mm. That would be advanced, yeah. So advanced will make sense. The top end doesn't there's no power on top end. It looks like we just might go like two cylinder after 
Yeah. So he was like, it's half the power. Yeah. No. It's like how it was running before. Like, I, I thought it was a turbo size. Oh. That's why I put yeah. the different turbo on. Oh, okay. Yeah. So you guys are gonna adjust the cams. This one. We're not gonna necessarily verify adjust, but we're, yeah, we are gonna verify that it's set correctly. We mimicked what was on the motor beforehand. I'm not saying that's the best way to do it. Obviously, uh, we're trying to rule out what the problem could be. We found a couple of little problems. The result we're getting on the dyno is a kind of a big problem, and we don't. We're not convinced that what we have going on is, or what we have found is the cause of the problem. So. There you go. You got it. Pull up a diagram again. Huh? Yeah, hit it. Okay, give me one more. One more of those, yeah. Okay. Real light. Yeah. One more. One more. One more. Oh. It just went past. But it's fine. It was it's closer now, it's just in the compression areas. We're like a, just a few degrees over TDC. What if it's off a tooth on the crank? Yeah, that's why that's why we need to put it in the TDC. If everything is advanced, then we'll do something. But no, I'm saying like in the timing, in the timing chain. Like even if it's at TDC and both cams, the cams are phased together correctly, but if they're both yeah 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 forward, that's what I'm saying. yeah, both could be forward or. Based on all these photos, it looks like they're both forward. Because the lobes should be even to each other. Wouldn't that create a problem See? all the time? So, but we have to be at. Uh, no, because exactly. it's just gonna run out of it's just gonna run out of breath. Because yeah, like these lobes should be according yeah, to all these photos, be... like like this. Yeah. So this is it, it. It looks like to me that both cams are out of balance right now. If mm -hmm. this is a TDC, yeah, it's like this. Yes. It has to be one back. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. You guys wanna turn the crank back and forth a little? Just make sure that be down. the right, mark right, you right, have right. is a zero. Oh. Yeah, because this is way too low than the picture you showed me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, because like they should be even. Yeah. I know that they're not. Um, no way, this, this, this is that low. So, yeah, which would make sense why it would torque up, you know, kind of quick, but then fall yeah, in space. It falls off, yeah, because we are we're basically straight up now, right? On this one. Yeah, this one's straight up. Yeah, and that one's leaned back. back, and then this one is parallel, and it should be up one. Yeah, so it is off. We are a half. It's it's like a half tooth off, which makes sense if it's one off on the bottom, right? Yeah. I'd say like to put a TDC and all that, but we'll that'll be easier to figure out than what we're doing. Let's get some RTV. Let's get some red on here. I see. <laughs> it is fast. We'll go with the blue. Yeah. Our blue uh, valve cover seal. You said you wanted to change that. Did you get the new one? Mm -mm. I was just going to paint it. <laughs> <laughs> we believe both cams are advanced, as if it's off a tooth here. We are about to F around and find out. Yeah, bud. Yeah, bud. You got it. Sweet. That was sick. Nice work. I'll okay, the chain. we got the paint mark. I'll hold the chain. Yeah, we got our paint mark. We rotate this guy. No, rotate the cam. Yeah, rotate both yeah, cams. Rotate both cam shafts. Get um, get the crescent, crescent. So that guy actually here. bumped up. He's actually kind of happy. Clean off your fingies and pull up that. Uh, no, he's picture. actually kind of happy. Yeah. You gotta move this guy first. You gotta take take, take it off. Let that off of the bottom because yeah, we gotta oh, yeah, 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 skip yeah. it to it. Hang on, step, 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 step. Okay, so now bring that guy back. Where's me? Hang on, watch this. Uh, oh, there's my mark. You're gonna so wanna now, get it. Yeah, give you're me. gonna wanna get a tooth off of that paint marker, you know? Nope. No, we wanna go right on that paint mark. Oh, true. Because he already broke in, bottom, in right? relation to each other, yeah. Okay, so now bring me. You can see that you can watch it. You know where it's. For more calculation, we're at the TDC. Those lobes are now even with each other. They're the equal distance. That guy. They're the equal distance up. Yeah, because yeah. Yeah, that's what you want. You want mm -hmm. them moving the same way. And your notches are in the and same And you got, spot. so pull this guy over because he's over center, but we got slack in the chain. Remember when you thought the last video was long? <laughs> <laughs> so to catch you guys up, 
wasn't timed. Thank you. And now we should be good. So they're putting everything all back together. Yeah, it was off a tooth. <laughs> He's was that a dipstick? Was that a dipstick? Chris is like, just throw it on. <laughs> I was like, no! Twice is two times too many. That one is like the bottom right here. Yeah, so I want the front one. Sorry. Yeah. Cover, brother. Cover. Cover. <laughs> See what you did there. Nice. Nice one, Thanks. Oh, yeah, brother. Nice. All right, let's fire this thing up, huh? Uh, ratchet's out. Yeah, it works. So we're clear. Socket. Right. No, yeah. just um, um, yeah, just just hit it. Good. Good. Yep. Good. Try it. It was at this moment that he knew he f***ed up. Oh, wow. Are you okay? Yeah, that was my ear. Might do it again. Yeah, cover your cover your ears. ears. Ready? Yep. Yep. Alright, shut up. Okay, we just need to get the timing. I can taste that one. It tastes like lead. Yeah. Um, so this fuel pump's going out. Fuel pump's going out. Four hundred. Yeah, this one's probably got like a three hundred in it. They gave us an extra shake. You want a shake? Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so cute. <laughs> Oh yeah, a little baby. <laughs> well, I'm tired. <laughs> I don't want to do this anymore. Yeah, brother. Yeah. One thirty in the morning, and the jokes are still rolling. <laughs> <laughs> Cut out there. Jesus Christ. All right. The very last one was 10 pie. Yeah, that's that's enough to kill it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> How close were you to done? I was almost done.
by Chris. Woo! Quick breakdown of the breakdowns. Uh, breakdown of the breakdowns. <laughs> Seemed like it started off okay. <laughs> he laughs. Well, you saw the whole first initial thing when you started putting power to it, it was just falling off and knew something was wrong. Yeah, you know, my gut told me that the cam timing was wrong when I first saw it, but I've never done a KA before. Um, and that's the way it was. That's the way this motor was when we got it, when it was ran, when it was together. So I don't know how long that power ran this motor in that way, but someone did. That's how we set it up. We got that fixed. So once we figured that out, it's like, we're here, let's do it. So blew the valve cover off, blew the front end off, retimed it, got it all back together, re-stabbed it with a dizzy, got it going, started running good, started making power. Start running out of fuel. We had that little 255 wall bro from 2009 in there. And now this thing's finally making over 300 wheel. It was topped out. Went and got one of our spare Deechworks pumps, put it in there, 400 um, liter pump, so plenty of juice. So that ran it up. Koji started cleaning up the map because he was trying to just punch it in with fuel, um, or punch in the fuel through the injectors. And so now we got the pumps, so we had to back it down. Then it was starting to run good again, and then all of a sudden it was the uh, alternator was dead. The last like power pull or two, it was running low voltage, so it was giving him a false read. So basically when the voltage starts dropping, everything starts slowing down. And so he's tuning to that. We get the <laughs> charger box out, get it back up to 13. Now it's running uh, crazy rich. So even that back out and here we are. So put on a trailer. Yeah, see you at the track in three hours, four hours? Oh, uh, it's 2.45. We don't gotta be there till eight. <laughs>